Hey guys, so today's video is going to be a July favorites. I can't believe July is over. We're in August and I give birth in October. So it is going by really fast. But I haven't done one of these videos in so long. I have a lot of goodies that I want to share with you guys. A lot of them you might have seen on Snapchat if you follow me there. Or on Instagram. So if you don't, I will leave my social medias down below because it's so much easier to get to me during those two. Snapchat or Instagram. I'm finally getting the hang of Snapchat. So yeah, let's be friends there. So let's get started. The first thing I have is this Shea Moisture 10 in 1 Renewal Shampoo. I had a sample size. I cannot tell you guys how I got a hold of one, but I got one and I loved it. So my sister who went to BeautyCon, well, I went to BeautyCon too, but I did not get in. That's a whole different kind of drama. Anyways, so she actually got in and in the, you know, goodie bag, there was one of these and she gave it to me. So I'm really excited because I really love this shampoo. My hair feels healthy after I use it. It feels soft. It feels shiny. It is really amazing. So I love this stuff. So I'm recommending this. I think, I think you could get this at Target maybe, but it's really good shampoo if you have dry hair like I do. The next thing I have, I know I hauled this for you guys for my Fame Expo haul. This is from a company called Rock Your Hair. I bought these two items for $5 a piece. This right here and this right here, I think they're normally $18 a piece. So I know I got a good deal at Fame Expo. But the dry shampoo, besides the packaging being super cute, which is why I bought it. And I told you guys on my haul. The product inside, this is amazing. This dry oil mist it just leaves the hair so shiny. That's what I have on my hair right now. It's just amazing. And the dry shampoo does not leave any really white residue. It's pretty good stuff. And it's a lot of product that I got for five bucks a piece. I know that the price is like normally like $18. I'm not familiar if they have any sales or anything like that. But they're definitely worth a try. The next thing I have is something that I posted on Instagram quite a lot because I really love it and like literally it's gone it is the natural dermis hydrate lotion this is a all vegan all cruelty free all natural face care line and this stuff is amazing I love it guys this stuff has changed my skin completely uh, I do have a discount code if you guys want to use it if I have a discount code for anything, I will leave it down below. Some stuff I get commissions, some stuff I don't, I will leave that info down below. But you guys don't have to use it. I'm just letting you guys know that I do have discount codes for some stuff. But this stuff, you guys, I I just, this is it. This is it for me. The face wash, the scrub, the night cream, and this, which is the hydro, which I put under my foundation. It's amazing. It definitely has changed my skincare. And if I could recommend anything to you, it is this. The next thing I have for you guys is my Too Faced. It's called the Love Flush Blushes. Okay, so I was lucky enough that Too Faced sent me a package and it had all the blushes. And I was really curious about trying them. I own Too Faced. I own quite a lot of stuff before they send me things. And I am already a fan of the brand before they send me things. I was really interested in trying their blushes because I love their blushes that come in their holiday sets, which is normally how I have them. These are impressive, you guys. They have, uh, besides the packaging, because the package is freaking cute. It's long wearing. The product inside is incredible. I am wearing, what am I wearing today? To wear it, today I'm wearing I Will Always Love You and Love Hangover mixed together. I love to mix them because some of them are shiny, some of them are matte, it just kind of depends. But these, if I can open one, look like this from the inside. They have the two bunnies because it is a cruelty-free vegan line, which I love. And they are very, very pigmented. I love these. If you guys want a full review on all of them with swatches, please let me know because I do have all of them. But I do recommend these. I have worn them from like 9 a.m. to 9 p.m. And like right now, I've been wearing it for... Maybe around five hours and it still looks good so I don't normally don't have to retouch and all the colors that they have 
seem to work for me except for one but then I mix it with something else and then I create a whole new different color so if you're contemplating if you should get one you you should because they are that long wearing next thing I have are my Ultra liquid lipsticks today I'm wearing the color Panama they are amazing they just came out with new shades if you haven't seen my review on these I'll leave them down below but they're worth mentioning again because they're that good I use them all the time the next thing I have is Becca this is champagne pop you guys I if you don't know what champagne pop is I don't know where you'll be living because everybody here on YouTube got champagne pop because it's created by Jaclyn Hill and I'm one I'm somebody who wants to support fellow youtubers and I love highlighters so this is what I'm wearing this is what I've been wearing it's amazing for all skin tones it is highly pigmented you can still find it I believe because I think they restocked so yeah I would try to get my hands on this because it is limited edition if you love highlighters and you love Jaclyn and you love Becca I mean it's like a win-win-win but it's not just a hype this is not a product that is not, it's not just the hype. It is worth every single penny. So I'm debating if I should get a backup. I don't know. You guys let me know. Should I? This is pretty good. So I definitely recommend you picking one up. So the next thing I got is this little puppy right here. I was gifted this by Too Faced. It was a surprise in the mail. It was a hell of a surprise. I was very, very excited to get all the foundations from Too Faced. 12 of them. Uh, I know that the lightest shade that they have right now is porcelain and they're coming with two lighter shades and then the darkest shade which is actually what I'm wearing which is caramel uh, they're coming out with four shades darker than that because if you see my review or maybe you haven't I will link it down below I have a review from a few weeks ago on this foundation uh, I at that point I was the color honey and now I am the color in I'm in between these two so I mix them both uh, but caramel is the darkest color and I didn't think that was pretty cool because there are girls who are a darker shade than me that need this foundation this foundation to me is the ultimate foundation I have oily skin and I don't see any oiliness I mean it's not a matte finish you guys this is not a matte finish foundation this is a satin finish so you're gonna see a glow a natural glow that's why it's called born this way because nobody's really matte face like let's just face it and lately I noticed that as I get older I don't want to look matte I feel the way that if I look if I go for a matte foundation I just look older and it doesn't look natural I've been liking the dew you guys I've been liking looking satin and glowy and I've just been really enjoying it because I feel like it makes me look younger and I don't feel like I look 34 so I mean at least I don't think I do and if you think I do, don't tell me. <laughs> but for me, at least, I feel like the foundation, it's very natural looking and I love it. I can wear it all day. And I am oily skin, so I mean, this is pretty amazing. I do have a full review with a demo. I will leave it down below, but this is my Holy Girl foundation. And I'm really excited that they sent me all these because now I can start my kit to freelance, and which is something that... I get emails all the time if I freelance or not and I didn't have a kit so now I'm gonna get my kit started and it is definitely helping me out but besides all that I really love this foundation from the beginning another thing I like about this foundation is that I never have to set it and it lasts from like 9 a.m. to 9 p.m. and I love the fact that I don't have to set it because like I said I don't like looking matte anymore if I do set it, it's just definitely around the nose but that's about it to me this foundation it's everything like you guys have no idea and this foundation is everything to me so yeah I'd recommend it that is it I shall see you guys later bye